Welcome, welcome to this cardio step and hit class. So in today's class, let's tap it. I want you right now to have a step bench with one riser. We're going to march it right to left. We're going to get right into the combination. Good morning. We're going to do a basic step and then a rock back. Three more. Basic step on the bench and rock back. Basic step. We're warming it up in track one. Just warming it up. Again, so you go basic step, rock it back. Basic step, rock it back. One more time. Basic step. Now one repeater knee. Good morning, everyone. Basic step, rock it back. So you step, whole foot on the bench, rock it back. Whole foot on the bench, rock it back. Cardio step to the beat. Three more, here we go. Basic, rock it back. You know my name is Angie, Angie Fitness TV. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're at. Beautiful repeater. Woo! You're gonna march in the right in the left corner. I'm gonna show you the next move. We're gonna up, tap, to step down. Up, tap, tap, step down. Up, tap, tap, come with me. Step, tap, tap, step down. Up, tap, tap, step down. Again, up, tap, tap, repeat her knee, repeat her knee. March in the right corner. Right there, so you step up with the left foot, tap over two, and then you step touch down. You think you can do that? Yes, this is, we're moving quick, I know. We're warming up with our first combination. Step, tap, tap, step down, up. Tap, tap, step down, again. Again, so it's two taps. Let's do three more. Up, tap, tap, step down, up, tap, tap. One more, then a repeater. One repeater, one repeater. Now you're gonna do a basic right, low jack. Basic right, two low jacks. Basic left, and you're doing a low jack. Basic right, low jack, you tap right. Basic left, Woo. Squat down and up. Squat. All right, you guys. We are right in it right away because it's a 35 minute workout. Cardio step to the beat and hit drills. Leave everything at the door from the top. Basic right. Rock it back. There we go. Two more. It's a basic right with the rock back. One more time. Basic right. Now one repeater knee. Three knees. We're gonna go on the left, basic left with the rock back three times. Two more times. That's a combination. Getting nice and warm. One more time. You know you're gonna do a repeater knee right now. We're gonna come to the left corner. We're gonna step two, tap. Step, tap, tap, exit. Two more. You're getting that combo. One more. Repeater knee, three knees, three knees. You're gonna come to that right corner, up, up, tap, tap, step down. Two more, beautiful. One more, it's an up, tap, tap, repeat her knee. You got it, basic right, and that low jack. Tap, now basic left, Woo! low jack, basic right. You're low jacking right then left, basic left. You got it. Let's squat down and up. Seven working tracks. You're in track one. Teaching the, you the choreography. 128 beats per minute. Beautiful job. Down and up. Let's do heels right to left on the bench. Pull. Woo! Again. Now, we're gonna take this combination up to 130 beats per minute. So if you wanna grab a riser, grab a riser now. Grab a riser, put it underneath, right now. 
and then you're gonna march it right to left. You're gonna make sure your bricks, I'm just saying hi, good morning, Laura, good morning, Roland. Okay, you're gonna march it right, left, right, left, right here. Track two, I'm taking the beats of this combination up to 130 and with two risers. Are you all ready from the top? Basic right, rock back three times. Basic right, whoo, rock back two more times. You know the combination because I previewed it. Basic right, now one repeater knee, hoop. Now basic left, rock back. Basic left, rock it back. Two more sets, basic combination is simple. Tons of repetition. Basic with the rock back. Now repeater, you're gonna come in the left corner. You know you're gonna step up, tap two, and exit. Two more times. Step, tap, tap, exit. One more, hoop. Repeater knee. You're gonna come in that right corner. Same thing, same move. It's an up, tap, tap, exit. Two more sets. Beautiful job with two risers. Repeater knee. Basic two jacks. Basic left. Basic right. Two jacks or low jacks. Basic left. Woo! Squat, clap, down. Woo! You've left everything at the door. You're here with me right now in this very moment. Right? We're gonna go through that combination again. From the top, basic right, rock back three times. How you doing? Woo, heart rate is high. I forgot to turn on my little heart rate. Woo, repeat. Basic left, rock back. Two more sets. Really use the space of the room. One more, basic left. Now repeat our knee, that's three knees. We're gonna come to the left corner. You know we're gonna step tap two and exit. Woo! Three more sets. You know this combination. Two more, or actually this is your last one. Repeat or knee, repeat or knee. We're gonna come in that right corner. Same move, up, tap, tap, exit. Two more sets. Heart rate's high. One more. Repeat. Basic. Right, two jacks, high or low. Basic, left. Basic, right. Basic, left. Squat, clap, hoop. Come on guys. You're here to discover what your body can do for you. This is a beautiful power push. From the top, basic right, rock back. Let's get through it again. That's a combination, but I am playing with the beats per minute. Now one repeater, three knees on the left. Beautiful. Basic left, rock back three times. Got it? Left lead. Two more times. One more, one more. You know you're gonna do a repeater on that right knee. We're gonna come to that left corner. Step it up, two taps, and exit. Two more sets. We're almost done with track two. We're going into cardio hit. One repeater knee. You're gonna go to this right corner, same move. Up, tap, tap, exit, hop. One more, one more. Beautiful job. Repeater knee. Let's finish strong. Basic jack, high or low. Whew. Getting ready to go into cardio hit. Alternating the basic right and left. One more. March, right to left. Whew. Now that's it. So you guys, on the cardio step, I'm going to the beat. But I'm playing with the beat. So we started at 128. Now we're at 130. The next time we hit this combination, we're gonna be at 135. Now you're gonna, come on. Woo, as quick as you can. Outside lead leg hits us. This is 
Track three, hit. Hit it. I don't care how quick or how slow you go. These are your hit drills. You have two hits in today's workout. Push your intensity. Push, 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 push. Go as quick or as slow as you want. Focus on what your body can do for you. You got one or two risers on. Whew. Come on, let's go. Other side, march it. Now again, your intensity. The hit drills are meant to go at your intensity, your pace. Got it? When they say hit it, go at your intensity, guys. Go. You have four more hit exercises. Now you can go quicker than me, slower, whatever. My heart rate is 143. I'm good. You can stay low impact, no jumping. You can go higher intensity. You are strong, you are fit, you are powerful. Yeah, your call. You can add another riser if you are an expert stepper. Turn around. Arms, they dive up every time you tap. You can add a hop. You can stay low impact the entire workout. Thumbs up, let's go. Push it guys, you got two cardio hit drills. Using that step bench. Beautiful, 35 minute, heart healthy. Cardio workout, utilizing that step bench. The cardio combination is really simple. You know what it is. I'm playing around with the beats per minute today. Goes quick or slow, turn. Woo! We're getting a lot of beautiful lateral movement in. Give me a beautiful thumbs up. Sweaty day, sweaty, beautiful, heart healthy day. That's why you're here, that's why I'm here. We're blessed to move. Go. Go. If you want to take it up a notch, add that hop. Use those arms. Go. Come on. Move quicker than me if you want. Woo. I'm not talking because I'm working. Using those arms. Using that step bench, two risers. Right. Woo! Come on over here. You can walk across. You can hop across. Last two hit exercises. And then we hit that cardio step combination again at 135 beats per minute. Go. Up to you. Lower intensity, walk. You just walk. Higher intensity, you hop. Your call, lateral movement, if you haven't noticed. Working that lateral movement here. Your timing, your pace. Using this beautiful step bench to elevate our heart rate. Working on heart health. One more time, look at me. You are strong, fit, and powerful. You have one more, I think. If they don't tell us to go, we don't go. Woo! I do think that's it. I think on this, on this particular CD, it's five exercises, not six. Okay, it is. So we're done. I want you to step touch any way you want. Now, I'm giving you a heads up right now. We're going back into that cardio step combination, but the beats per minute are now going to be 135. We started with the warm up at 128. Then we did the combination with an extra brick at 130. We're gonna keep that brick on and we're gonna go 135. But I'm telling you right now, march it. If you can take that extra brick away, you can just use that step bench. So right now, I'm playing with your heart rate. Okay, are you ready? You know the combination. I've already taught it to you twice. So you've got that repetition down from the top. Basic right, rock back three, 135. Whoo, I got that two risers or two bricks. One more. You got one repeater knee. You know the drill. 
basic left, rock back three, up, up. Feel the beat changing. We're gonna get as fast as 140. So you have to pace it. Repeat your knee. We're gonna go in that left corner, up, tap two, and exit. Hup. Watch your footing, whole foot on the bench. One more, one more. You know the combo. Repeat your knee, repeat your knee. You're gonna come in the right corner. You're gonna do the same thing. Up, tap, two, exit. Three more sets. One more. Repeat your knee, repeat your knee. You're gonna do a basic right, jack, then basic left. You know it. Whoop. Basic left, march or jog it up. Two more, basic right. You got it. Basic left, basic left. You get that squat clap. Here we go. Push. Cardio step to the beat. Playing with the beats per minute. We're gonna go from the top. Basic right, rock back. Three times, here we go. Whoo! Two more sets. I don't want you to have to think too much about the combination. One more. Repeat her knee, repeat her knee. Whole foot on the bench, guys. Shoulders melt away from your ears. Basic left rock, back three. Whew. Two more. You are strong, fit, and very powerful. Come on, heart healthy workout. Repeat her. You're gonna come to the left corner. Step, tap, two, exit. Come on. Hup. One more set. Repeat her knee in the left corner. You're gonna come to that right corner. Let's do that same move three times. Two more sets. One more set. Repeat her knee. Basic right, two jacks. Basic left, two jacks. We're gonna try to run through this. Again, basic right. Basic left. Heart rate's high. You get a squat clap to the beat. Whoo! Beautiful job, look at me. You've left everything at the door. You're focusing on you and your body movement. Your heart help from the top. Basic right, rock back three. Last time through. Two more sets. Heart rate, 153, I told you. Playing with the beats per minute. Really jacking that heart rate. Repeater, repeater. Hup. Basic left, rock back. Hup. Two more sets. It's a little harder for me to free talk when I teach cardio step. Woo, because I got to concentrate in the core. Repeater, repeater. I got to concentrate on the choreography. Come to the left, up, tap, two, exit. Let's go. One more time, one more time. Repeater here in the left corner. Look at that right corner. Same move three times. Two more. One more time. Repeater knee, right knee does three knees. You get a basic right, lower high jack. Whole foot on the bench. Basic left. Basic right. Basic left. Squat clap to the beat. I think we're gonna get one more track. One more time through. You're in track four of seven. Track seven is your cool down. From the top, basic right, rock back three. Let's see how far we get. Two more. Whole foot on the bench, guys. Don't let that ankle dangle. That's really bad. Three left knees right now. Basic left, rock back three times. Woo! Two more sets. One more, you know the drill. You know this combination, so play. Repeat her knee, three knees on the right. You're gonna look, left corner, up tap, two exit. Again. One more. Repeat her knee, right in the left corner. You're gonna come to the right corner. Do the same move, let's finish. Again, we can finish the side to even it out. Hup. Repeat her knee, repeat her knee. 
You're gonna come on your bench. Woo! You ready? Track five. Cardio hit. We're gonna go into that beautiful football run or that straddle. Outside lead legs. Five exercises. Go. Let's go. I still got those two risers. Are you focusing on what your body can do? A beautiful 35 minute heart healthy workout. You get to push as hard as you want, or you can make this a light day by just not using your blocks or your risers and just using that step bench. You can wear a weighted vest, turn around. So right now, it's all about heart health. You guys, we do need to strength train, but we also need to work on our cardiovascular system. And that's exactly what we're doing right now. Push if you want, stay low impact, low intensity. Low impact, low intensity, you do no jumping whatsoever. You always keep one foot on the ground. Now you can add a third riser if you've done this workout before and you're watching it recorded. So you can change the intensity by adding a riser, adding a weighted vest, adding egg weight, turn around. Next one, you can hop, you can stay low impact, but I need you to march. Hello, hello guys. You getting a good workout, thumbs up. Yeah, Laura, Janet, Roland, let's go. go. Woo, in my new studio, guys, I'm gonna have a huge TV up. So I'll be able to read your comments while I am doing the lives. Right now, I have a very small computer so I cannot read your comments as we're doing the actual workout because my eyesight <laughs> without glasses is very poor. I need a huge monitor so I can read it without glasses. Yes. Other side. So right now what I use is my Apple computer, but the comments are so small. I couldn't even begin to read them if I wanted to. So my new studio, you're gonna be like, oh my gosh, she read my comment. No. Yeah, isn't that exciting? I'm gonna buy a big, big monitor. I'm gonna have it right there. It's gonna be magnified by 150%. <laughs> so I can read it from far away. Go as quick or as slow as you want, guys. You got one more exercise over the bench. Five hit exercises. Let's push. Woo! Woo! Rest. Okay, this is it. Give me this beautiful thumbs up. Do you feel that beautiful sweat dripping down your body? And you're just like, oh, such a privilege to sweat and move. One more, you can walk or you can hop. Let's go. go. Now, if you walk, remember, no jumping, guys. To keep that lower impact, you can shuffle across or you can hop across. You can shuffle. I'm going to stay with a beautiful shuffle. You get to go where you want to go. We have one more track. Track six. Oh my gosh, guys, you're going to love this. The beats per minute on the combination will be 140. Rest. Rest. Right to left. Now, look at me. Actually, look at me. The beats per minute in track six are 140 beats per minute on this combination. Right now is the time. If you have two risers, knowing the beats are 140, take a riser off if you have two risers or leave it on for a challenge. Now, if you're newer to step, simply use your step bench by itself or put that step bench off to the side and use the floor because I'm warning you, 140 beats per minute. That's quick, that's fast. Look at me, your body, your ankles, your feet. Your whole foot will step on the bench, you're marching. Whole foot will step off the bench. If your ankle dangles, I've had that happen. Woo, march it right to left. You don't want any dangling ankles. I've actually sprained my ankle teaching group fitness class a lot. From the top, basic right rock back, three times. Here we go. Woo. 
140. Let's go again. So today, really playing with the beats. That's why I said cardio step to the beats. Repeat her knee, repeat her knee. Basic left, rock back three. Three times. Feel it. Whoo! I'm gonna keep that riser because I know I can push it. One more. Hook. Now repeat her. Three knees. We're gonna come to the left corner. You're gonna get a step, two tap, and exit. Two more sets. One more set, then you're gonna give me repeater. Repeater. Whole foot on the bench, come to the right corner. Same move. This is it, guys. Cool down after this. Feel the difference, guys. Repeater, repeater. Basic right jack, then basic left jack. Basic left. Two more, basic right, then left. Come on, let's see how many we can get through. Last push, squat, clap, squat, clap. Woo! Final, final push. From the top, basic right, rock back. Three times. Basic, and it's that right foot that rocks. Repeat her knee, repeat her knee. Same thing, basic left, basic left, rock back three times. Again, 140, kicking our butt. Repeater, you know you're gonna step up. Tap two, exit in the left. Hook. Two more sets. One more. Repeater, repeater. You're gonna do the same thing in the right corner. Remember, you don't need any step bench. Two more. One more. Yeah, you hear my breathing. Beautiful repeater knee. Basic jack. Basic right, basic left, basic left. Whole foot on the bench, guys. Shoulders set back down and away from your ears. Basic left. Squat, clap, here we go. We're gonna run through it. Hopefully, two more times, but one more time. From the top, last two pushes. Basic right, rock back three times. Heart rate for me, 156. I'm there, I'm in that zone. Beautiful repeater knee. Wow, we're kicking butt today. Basic left, rock back three times. Whole foot on the bench, guys. Can't say that enough. Whew, make sure your bricks are secure, always. Repeater, repeater. Come in that left corner. You know you were gonna step up and tap two and exit. Two more sets. One more time. Beautiful repeater knee. Same thing in that right corner. Let's go. Two more sets. Hoop. One more. Beautiful repeater knee. Basic right. Two jacks and you switch left. Whew. Yeah, killing it. Two more sets and we squat clap. Beautiful, basic, straightforward cardio step. Squat, clap, hook. Beautiful, motivational cool down. Coming up next. Let's do one more round. Basic right, rock back three times. Whoo, two more. I do believe this is our last pass. So give it to me. Repeat her knee, repeat her knee. Basic left, rock back three times. Beautiful, sweaty, heart healthy workout, man. Playing with the beats, the intensity, repeater. Come on, challenging to change. Up tap two. Again. One more. Repeater knee. Let's hit the left corner. Or the right corner. Ha! This is it. <clears throat> Music's changing. Repeat. 
march it right to left. Woo! Dreams, goals, Fill your heart expectations. Soul. Just step touch. We touched. all have them. Some realistic, some not so it's realistic. Time to come down. But to be Feel honest, your heart and soul. most of listen. our dreams, goals, and expectations Just watch haven't me manifested listen. in our lives Deep yet. You see, most of us expected to be in better positions than we are today. Exhale. Better car, better job, better all-round lifestyle. You can achieve all those things, but you have to stop living up to others' expectations. Stop trying to live Exhale. other people's dreams. Stop trying to achieve Shoulder rolls. other people's goals and go out and conquer your own. Fill your heart and soul. When it comes to the end, will you look back and be proud at what you've achieved? Feel your heart and soul. Do you live your life on purpose? Let's or stretch. are you another blind rat in the worldwide rat race? You are special, unique, one out of one. Right Stop here. trying to be someone else and start being the best you. Dream your own dreams. Set your own goals. Live up to your own expectation. Believe in yourself. Believe in your dreams. Left heel. Believe your expectations. If you consider your life is a movie, you are the director. You are in charge of your own life. Believe your own goals. Grab Believe your right in foot. you. There will be many people in your life with good intentions that have unrealistic expectations for your future. They won't be unrealistic because they expect too much from you, but rather unrealistic because they expect too little. Your father, mother, or Grab friends might foot. mean well, but you have to set the standard in your own life. You can outperform your parent and their expectation. It isn't against the law. You can break free from your peer group Grab that right and wrist. become the leader of the pack. You can set the standard, set the example, Every day, make sure that you commit to making yourself a better you. Grab and your slowly, left wrist. But surely, you'll get closer and closer to your goals. You cannot live your life trying to be someone else. You cannot live your life trying to be something Look over you're your not. left shoulder. You aren't a clone or a carbon copy of your idols. Live your own life. That's the beauty of life. Look over your right. We're all different. We don't all want the same career, same money, same partner, same house. Roll we it up. Are individuals, and so our dreams should be individual to and us. And roll it down. Stop trying to keep up with everybody else. Life isn't a race. It's an individual journey. Give it your all. Everything you need is inside you already. You have the whole world at your oyster. Life is just one big opportunity. Are you directing your life on purpose? Interlace your fingers. Do you guide your dreams Chest to expansion. reach your destination? Every step. Every moment is a crucial component of your life. Every day, every moment, every second, every Step decision on your bench. is a crucial component of your right life. Heel down. You will not be perfect. No one is perfect, but you will be deliberate. You will be on purpose and you will be in charge. In charge of your life, in oh, yeah. charge of your destiny. I am. Just do Are you? something. Do whatever you can. Take Love action. Teal. Take the first Calf steps. Stretch. You will discover you are much more than you thought you were. There really are no limits. Keep focused and find a way to reach the top. You can have anything you put your mind to. Follow your heart and go for the things your soul really wants. Go Take for the things your higher the right. being really wants. Fulfill your destiny. Live your own life. Live your dreams. To the left. Be fearless. Deep breath in, be fearless. Inhale. And exhale. I thought, I hope that last track really, really motivated and talked to your soul. You guys, this is a beautiful cardio step to the beat where we played around with the beats per minute with the basic step combination. And we added some beautiful hit drills. This is a beautiful heart healthy workout. All I ask you is can you share, follow, click the button. And if you really truly like my workouts, please share it with your friends, your coworkers, your church members, just share it. Let's get everyone healthy, you guys. Okay, my name is Angie, Angie Fitness TV. Until next time, guys, bye. Okay, if you're staying with me, we, oh, okay, if you're staying with me for the second part of class, we are doing upper body pyramid training hit style. You are going to have three sets of weights, but I want you to have light weights 
all the way to heavy weights. Because sometimes when we get in and we're doing biceps and triceps, use your step, we're gonna use our step bench or the floor today to lay down, so have a mat. I'll be using my step bench. Um, and let me see. I'm just letting you guys know for the second part of class, I'll be using my step bench, okay? So that's the most important part. So you are going to want various hand weights for the second part of class. Woo, Fiona's here, Roland, Laura. So glad you guys are here. I'm gonna have class on Wednesday. I will have class on Wednesday as well, you guys. Okay, so it seems like my restream cut out on me a little bit. Let's see. Okay. Um, all right, so what I, what I need to know right now, can you guys hear, can you guys hear me, Laura? Uh, Laura, I need to know right now, can you hear me? That's all I need to know before I get into this. Okay, let's see. I am not hearing myself on here. Can you hear me? Okay, I can hear me. Okay, so I am on it. Okay, so are you guys ready for the second part of class? It is upper, it is upper body. So you guys, we are gonna work. I'm gonna really, really burn. This is a major push day. So do you have, oh, Laura! You guys, if you have your dip bars, if you have, you, okay, loud and clear, thank you, Ann. Okay, I'm so worried now, you guys, all the time. And I have checks and balances now on all my computers. Hey, grab your dip bars. I know some of you don't have dip bars, and no, they're not required. Dip bars are not required, but you know what? Because there's a lot of us that have them, we're gonna use them. Only if you have them. Of course I'll show you exercises if you don't have them. If you don't have the dip bars, I absolutely don't worry. So let me just tell you guys, I'm gonna have three pounds all the way to 20 pounds. We move quick, it's pyramid style. So I'm gonna talk you through absolutely everything. We have seven tracks. We have a beautiful quick warm up, and then we go into chest. So let me get us started right now because we gotta be right on time, 11.10. So I called this upper body. This is upper body uh, <laughs> pyramid hit style. You guys are gonna be like, wow, amazing. But push the weight, guys. You're gonna go light, heavy, or you're gonna go medium, heavy, heaviest. Medium, heavy, heaviest. Medium, heavy, heaviest. Let's go. All right, tap it right to left. Welcome you guys to this upper body pyramid strength training workout hit style. If you have dip bars, grab your dip bar. I'm gonna be laying down on my mat, on my step bench. You can lay down on your stability ball. You can lay down on your mat on the floor. All you really need are dumbbells. My name is Angie, leave everything at the door. Work out with me. So right here, let's start crossing. A quick two and a half minute warm up to get that upper body nice and warm. Now we have seven working tracks. Actually, about five working tracks because I always do a cool down. Now, we're gonna grab medium weights to begin with, then heavy, then heaviest. So you're gonna want a set of various hand weights in the front. One, two, right here, just getting nice and warm. If you feel this warm up is too short, go ahead, you could pause the video if you're watching this recorded, and you can do the warm up two times through. I want you to circle. One, two. Now you can bend your elbows if you're not quite nice and warm yet. Why don't we all bend those elbows? I'll assume we're all just starting to warm up. Now let's just keep going with this. Today I'm gonna work chest, back, shoulders, biceps, and triceps. Each body part, you have two exercises where we go medium weight, heavy weight, and heaviest weight. Okay? Woo, reverse the circle. Oh, now, I don't care how fast or how slow you go, when they say hit it, you get to just go two by two pattern, you can go faster. I care about the quality. 
Whew. Now front. Just take it right to 12 o'clock. Warming everything up with that upper body. So palm comes in at 12 o'clock. We're gonna start with the chest. I'll be laying down on my mat. Take it up. Thumbs up. Now if you have shoulder issues, you're gonna modify. If I'm doing a body weighted exercise you don't like, modify guys. This is a heavy push style upper body weight day, you guys. Okay, we're gonna do a reverse, reverse grip. So I'm gonna grab my 12s. So this is for chest. Your palms are facing in. This is a reverse grip barbell bench press. Hit it. So you're coming up and down. So right now, we're working medium weight. So I actually take it down out to the side. Palms are facing in. I, we're working our upper pecs right here. So you need your weights right by your side, you guys. Right now we're working medium weights. You can go down two, up two, down one, up one. It's up to you. Woo. Rest. Okay. So we had our palm facing in. Now our palm is going to be facing away. We're still using the medium weight. We're still using the medium weight. Palm faces away. Hold the weight up. Let's get some isometric Whoa. contraction. Now right here, your palm is totally facing away. Working your pector, your pector rest. My ball came off. You guys keep going. My microphone ball came on. Keep going, guys. Keep going. Okay, so nice. this is the time. Grab your heavy weight. If it's not right by you, grab that heavy weight. So we did medium, now we're doing heavy. We're going back to the reverse, so your palms will be facing in. Hold it in. Go. Now take it down. So you guys get the drill. We go medium, then we go heavy, and then we will go heavy is. Now if you're on really heavy right now, you can alternate. Palms are facing in. This is a reverse grip, barbell press. Elbows don't drop below your shoulders. Woo! Got those heavy weights. I don't care how quick and I don't care how slow. Now let's do palms facing away. You're at nipple line, you're at chest level right now. Let's hold this isometric contraction. Remember, when you start to go heavy, absolutely alternate and do unilateral movement. You can do both arms at the same time or you can just alternate. Now our next set, guys, you know what we're doing. You're gonna grab your heaviest weights. We move quick, we move fast, so I really need this weight to be medium, heavy, and heaviest. Don't drop the elbows below the shoulders. Rest. Okay, heaviest. So my, I have got to find half of my weights here. Okay, I'm on 20s. I think I'm gonna alternate. Go. Reverse grip. Oh yeah. So right now your palms are facing in. I got 20s in my hands. Oh baby, I don't care how fast. I don't care how slow. Oh! Oh yeah, those 20s are working me. Uh, come on, grit it, grit it, grit it. You left everything at the door. Rest. Hold it up, palms face away. Isometric contraction, you're at chest height. Absolutely alternate if you got those heavy weights. Whew. Let's go. go. Again, I am just alternating because of 20. I'm really pushing it for me. Don't drop that elbow. Oh, this is a really big push day, guys. We're here to really rev up our metabolism. We are here to focus on what our bodies can do for us. We are very strong. We are very, very powerful. 
recover. All right, guys, come to the back edge of your mat or back edge. Let's do push-ups to the end. I don't care how quick or how slow. Woo! Let's do push-ups. Back is coming up next. We're going to hit rear deltoids. So what is a medium weight for rear deltoids? What's a heavy weight? And what's a heavy ist weight for rear deltoids? Push-ups. Oh. After that medium heavy and heaviest weight, you should be shaking with the chest. Track three is all about the back. Medium. Heavy, heaviest weight. Oh. Woo. Oh, I'm shaking already. So for me, usually 12s, 15s, and 20s are good. Come on up, back time. Palms face up. I'll start with my 12s. Woo, first exercise, feet hip width apart. This is your back. Hit it. Right here, palms face up. Working that back. Medium weight. Am I tricking you with the medium weight? Right here. Elbows back, whatever that medium weight is. Because we're going to go into the heavy weight. And then heavy is. Woo. Beautiful sculpt tone. Define, rev up your metabolism. Press. Style workout. Okay, what's your heavy weight? Or oh, actually, reverse flies. For me, reverse flies, that's fives. <laughs> so you go feet hip width apart, hip hinge. Go! Right here, reverse fly. Squeezing, working that upper back. So my medium weight for me is five. So you guys, the key is to have all your weight by your side. No tension in your head, neck, or shoulders. Really squeeze that lemon in between your shoulder blades. Move through that wet cement. Woo! Rest. Okay, now medium weight. Palms are gonna face away. We're gonna come down, take the weights to the top of our knees. We're coming up, heavy weights now. Shoulder set back, down and away Go. from your ears. Now, right here, palms face away. Woo, squeezing that lemon in between your shoulder blades. Beautiful back work, we got the heavy weights. Oh, you can alternate if it starts to become heavy. Unilateral training, which is really good for the body. Woo! <sighs> Come on. Rest. Okay. Reverse flies. So for me, that's eight. Now, again, you can alternate one and the other or both together, but I'm gonna alternate. Go! Let's go. Reverse fly here. You can do both arms at the same time. You can alternate, but I have eights in my hands. So I really just want to alternate. I'll do a couple together. So switch it up. If you find the weight's getting too heavy, unilateral training. Focus on one side at a time. Beautiful muscular endurance challenge. Whoo! Rest. Okay. Grab your heavy ist weights, that's 20s. For me, feet hip width apart, shoulders back, palms face up, sit back in your heels, core engagement. Let's go. go. Oh, it's you and I, one at a time for me, because I'm getting that heavy weight. Working your back, beautiful movement here. Woo, got those 20s in my hands. I'm gonna try them together. I might go slower, but I'm really working that heavy end. Focusing on good form, good technique. Rest. Okay, heavy is weight for reverse fly. So for me, that's 10. I'm gonna do one arm at a time. Feet hip width apart, shoulders set back. 
Weights touch. Go. Move through that wet seam mat. You can try both at the same time if your form starts to go. Just do one arm at a time. Back work. Track four is going to be about the shoulders. We're going into shoulders after back. So we've already done chest. Now we're hitting back. Recover. All right. Woo. So you have three sets of weights, right? Medium, heavy, heaviest. Okay. Oh, shoot. You know what I wanted to do for back? Grab your dip bars. Grab your dip bars. Woo. If you don't have dip bars, do squats. Because that really is going to hit your glutes. And that's a part right here. If you have dip bars, if not, just march. Oh, I meant that. If you have your dip bars, grab your dip bars. Just go up and down. If you don't, just march. This is really quick. Going into shoulders next, you guys. Just keep the heart rate up. If you don't have the dip bars. Oh, you're marching or you're doing those beautiful pull-ups on the dip bar with me until the music changes. Let's go. I know you're burning. We got shoulders next, medium. Okay. Okay, so what do we have next? We have dumbbell scaption. So we're gonna take it up. I'm gonna have fives. Dumbbell scaption. You come up in a Y, Hit and you it. come down. Right here, medium weight. Thumbs up. Yes, I'm working shoulders. We're in the scaption plane right here. So you have your medium weight. Woo! Track four. All about the shoulders. We're gonna do rows for our shoulders. After this exercise, you got your medium weight. You're in a Y position. Rest. Okay. So what are you gonna use for your medium for upright row? I'll use my 12s again. Woo! Medium weight. Shoulder work right now. You can do it. Go. You're strong. You're fit. Powerful. You just take it to that chest height right here. Just take it to the chest height. Now you can already, I know we've already worked chest and back. So if you're starting to get a little fatigued, absolutely alternate. Beautiful. Upper body. Workout right here. West. Okay. Medium weight. What's your medium weight for the scaption? Mine is eight. Whew. You can alternate if you don't like doing both at the same time. You're on your heavy weight. Go. So right here. You're coming out to the corner. Now if you want to do both arms at the same time, go ahead. I have a heavy weight. I'm focusing on proper form and technique. You have a natural core engagement. I am in a split stance. Thumbs up. Start to think about what meat heavy weight you're gonna use for the row. Remember, we start Rest. with medium weight, then heavy weight, then heaviest weight. So you could be split stance. You can be feet, hip width apart, but everyone shoulder set back, both arms or one arm. Your call. I have 15s in my hands. So I'm good just alternating that right and that left arm. Push, push, push. Woo. I know we're working with that heavy weight. Focus on proper technique. Form. Rest. Okay. Heaviest weight for the Y scaption. For me, that's a 10. Again, split stance, feet hip width apart. Do it at the same time. Go. Or one arm. So for me, I like that split stance. Woo! 
Oh, working it, working it. Oh, don't be afraid of those weights, women. They are beautiful for your body. Absolutely beautiful for your body. Rest. Okay. Heaviest weight, 20s for me. For that row, feet hip width apart, shoulders set back. Whew. This is it, guys. And then we're going to hold the plank. Go. Oh, yeah. Only their chest height. I don't care how quick or how slow, the heavier the weight, you're going to automatically be slower. Get Working down over. in that plank. Get down in that high plank right now. We're taking this time. Right now you're working your entire upper body by holding your body weight in this plank position. Our next track is biceps. Track five of seven is biceps. So squeeze right now that quarter in between your butt cheeks. Squeeze that quarter in between your butt cheeks. Shoulders set back down and away from your ears. Squeeze that quarter in between your butt cheeks. Right here is a beautiful whole body movement. Core, back, chest, biceps, triceps, forearms. You're holding your own body weight. Beautiful challenge right here. We don't let any time go by. When they say rest, we're doing body weighted exercises. Beautiful, but I do want your shoulders to melt away from your ears. Come on up, medium weight, basic bicep curl. What are you gonna pick? Oh, I'll do, I'm gonna start with 10s. Are you ready? Bicep. Hit it. Hit it. You can use both arms. One arm, we're coming down the track, guys. Medium weight with your beautiful bicep curls. Right here. Let's go. You can do split stance or you can do feet hip width apart, but I do want your shoulders mounted away from your ears. Medium weight. This is the easiest that it gets. Right here. Rest. Okay. So our next one, we're gonna go ahead, hammer curl to an overhead press and down. Medium weight. I'm adding a little shoulder, but this is bicep work as well. Go. Hammer curl. Overhead press. Medium weights, guys. I have tens in my hands. That's my medium weight. My upper body's starting to get a little fatigued as we go through. I would do this workout once a week, guys. Really focusing on that medium heavy and heaviest weight. Don't you love this upper body? Pyramid hit strength training. Rest. Woo! Okay, now we're going to go into our heavyweight, bicep curl, heavyweight. So for me, that's going to be 12s today. Now each day it may be different for you. Whew, let's go. You can use, you can do one arm or you can do two arms. I think I'm sticking with the one arm. Whew, just as long as you have proper form and technique you guys don't let your body sway shoulders set back down and away from your ears you have a natural core engagement working on that bicep rest. hammer curl to overhead press heavy weight whatever that is for you whatever that is for you whatever your heavy is journal your weights guys journal your weights if you're going to be doing this workout and adding it into your playlist Go. Because each time you want to get just a little bit stronger, you want to add just a little bit of intensity to the workout. If you've been doing this workout with me for a while, absolutely you want to go ahead and just grab a set of heavier weights to challenge your body. You must challenge your body 
in order to change your body. Rest. Okay, heavy ist. Heavy ist. So for me, that will be 15s. Bicep curl. Again, you can go up two, down two with both arms. You can alternate. Go. Up to you. Beautiful. Oh, working it here. Oh, yeah. Rest. Just make sure you get both sides equally. Hammer curl, overhead press, heaviest weights. And then you're going to have a choice of a push up or you get to use your dip bars and work your pulling muscles. So you get to pick. If you don't have dip bars, you're gonna do push-ups, military or on your knees. If you have the dip bars, let's go ahead and do some more pull-ups. If not, you can do push-ups. You can use the mat to cushion your knees. Total major upper body challenge. This is a beautiful bone healthy workout, a beautiful, Rev up your metabolism workout. Recover. Okay. Push ups. Push ups or pull ups. You pick to the song end. Triceps are coming up next. Tricep overhead extension. So you're either doing a push up or you're doing a pull up. You get to pick, one is a pushing motion, one is a pulling motion, they're both functional movement, and they're both great to incorporate into this upper body workout. Let's go. Tricep overhead extension, coming up next. Woo! Song is going to end. Oh. Okay. Tricep overhead extension, medium weight, medium weight. So for me, that's going to be a 12, 112. I'm good. Tricep overhead extension. Here we go. Track six, guys. This is it. We've done the chest, we've hit the back. We've hit the shoulders and the biceps. Woo! We're gonna do tricep dips, hands on the bench, where you put one or two heavy weights on your lap. So you can put a medium weight on your lap, then a heavy weight, then the heaviest weight on your lap. Rest. So, whatever that is for you, what, what, what is a medium weight that you're gonna put on you. So for me, tricep dips. Woo! That's uh, two 15s. Go! I'll put two 15s. I got two 15s on my lap. This is my medium weight. I got two 15 pound weights on my lap as I'm doing tricep dips. Medium weight, guys. Medium weight because our next one is heavy weight then heaviest and we get a quick cool down for the upper body. Woo, revving up our metabolism, sculpting, toning and defining, beautiful bone healthy yes. workout. Okay, you can sit or you can stand. So before I had a 12, I'm gonna do 115. You can sit or stand, doesn't matter. We're gonna come with our heavy weight now. Go! Go! Oh yeah. Oh. Oh. Take that break when you need it. Uh. Woo. Yeah. Uh. Woo. Rest. What's your heavy weight for the tricep dips? Mine is gonna be a 20 now. 
and a 15 on my lap. 20 and a 15. Tricep dips. Or you don't have to have any weight. Go. Oh, she's me, yeah. Oh, I'll be 50 in September, guys. I'm right here with you. We can keep our muscles nice and strong through perimenopause and menopause. Really pushing for bone health. We want to reduce our chances of osteoporosis, osteopenia. Oh, working those triceps. Rest. Oh, okay, heavy ist. But if you're already fatiguing like I was, I'm going to have to go down to a 12. 12? Yeah. I mean, whatever. Go. I mean, this is my heaviest for me right now. I'm back at a 12 because I'm burning. Triceps always burn super quick for me. Oh, I'm just burning. Ooh. Triceps are my weakest link on my upper body. I'm always working triceps. Oh, I'm just burning. I'm working it. Okay. Heaviest dips, heaviest dips, heaviest dips. Okay, I'm gonna go 220s on my hips. Oh, I'm gonna go for it, mamacita! Let's go. This is it. We're gonna do high and low plank. 40 pounds on my hips. Woo, upper body. Pyramid strength training, hit style. Oh, shaking. I am shaking. You should be shaking. Oh, come up. I'm shaking. That's, that is a good feeling. It's a good feeling. Recover. Woo. Okay, put the weights down. You're going to recover. You're going to go into high plank and then low plank. And then high plank. And then that back arm, low plank. Finish. High plank to low plank for that upper, upper body. High plank to low plank, alternating the hand. Finish the song, finish the song. Alternating high plank to low plank. Wow, freaking amazing. Let's just do a little stretch for that upper body. If you need more of an extended stretch, go look in the description box below and look at one of my extended stretch playlists. Woo, awesome, upper body pyramid strength training, hit style. Now, if you didn't get a workout, it is most certainly not because of me. It is because you did not push hard enough. If you got a great workout, congrats, let's reverse. Congrats on this push. This is a heavy upper body push style day. You begin with medium, you go heavy, you go heaviest, and then I burn you out with a body weight. Ha! Yeah, baby. Let's get a beautiful tricep stretch. Now I'd recommend you do this, add this to your Routine once a week, guys. Journal your weights. Notice, go up each workout by one pound if you can. Let's do that other tricep. Just stretching really quick that upper body, guys. If you need more of a stretch, you know what to do. Look in that description box below. Interlace your fingers. Beautiful chest expansion here. Right ear, right shoulder. And left ear, left shoulder. Chest expansion, inner. One more time, right ear, right shoulder. And left ear, left shoulder. Let's get that shoulder stretch. Woo! Beautiful, quick upper body stretch. I am so, so proud of you guys. Let's get that other arm. Oh, beautiful. 
Now let's stretch out that back. Look over the left shoulder. Look over your right shoulder. Stretching out that upper body, guys. Look over that left shoulder. And look over that right shoulder. All right, come on up. Just heavy weight with your right hand. Soft bend in your knees. Circle. And now, left hand circles, dead weight. Let it just circle. Gravity is letting it circle. This is called the pendulum circle. Pendulum circle, right here. Now, let's just take it, stretch out that right here. Don't worry, just wanna stretch out that upper body because we worked really hard. And here, don't pull on your fingers, just a nice, gentle stretch. Beautiful job today. I'm so proud of each of you. Let's do a deep breath in. Beautiful inhalation. And exhale. We are done. My name is Angie, Angie Fitness TV. I teach group fitness classes every week on YouTube and Facebook. So I hope you subscribe, share, follow. And please, if you love me, tell your friends about me. Blog, share with your coworkers, your church members. You know, women that are 40 and above, hey, it's beautiful to get this style of workout in. All right, guys, my name is Angie, Angie Fitness TV, and I'll see you for our next workout. Have a beautiful day, guys. Bye. Hey, if you're staying with me, I will chit-chat really quick. Let me get a my ball to step on. Oh, and then you're here with me after class. So also, um, I want you to know I'm going to have class on Wednesday. Wednesday class, everyone. Okay, let me turn off my camera here. Let me lift this up. Hello. All right, Laura, burn, burn, burn. JD of love, great class, thank you. Well, I'm so glad you're here. So I'm so excited to, do I have like lipstick everywhere? Yeah, I have, okay, I have lipstick everywhere, but you know what, that's when you wear red, that's what happens. Uh, oh, thank you, Anne. Patricia White, I will definitely, definitely do this part this afternoon. I should be doing it now, but like to watch first to know what I'm getting into. Yes, perfect, Patricia. Perfect, perfect. Karen, oh my, love the upper body strength. I'm pooped. Well, my arms, woo, that's what it's about, Karen. So glad. I saw the picture of you and your daughter too, Karen, on Facebook. Absolutely gorgeous, the two of you. So uh, yeah, look at all my red lipstick. That's what happens. Anytime you get red, it just goes everywhere. Uh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful class today. We're going to have class on Wednesday. So excited. So you guys are going to get me on Wednesday as well. And after that... Um, oh, thank you, Laura. Th Laura, you're just such a sweetheart all around. Okay, so I'll let you know. After Wednesday, I may do a Friday class, a rebounding. So I may do Monday, Wednesday, Friday this week because next week I will be in Wisconsin getting my entire studio together for you guys because I'm actually going to make my way back to Wisconsin for a week before I come back to Tennessee. And you're going to get me for another week for live classes. And then I'm up in Wisconsin for good. So me and my husband, he came home this weekend, and we absolutely figured it out for sure our agenda. My son, um, yeah. So, oh, Laura, the pull-ups on the dip bars. Oh, my gosh, what a fantastic training. Yes. Laura, I was specifically thinking of me and you. And I know I think Roland has dip bars. And I was thinking of us, and I'm like, I have got to pull those dip bars out and I've got to, I've got to do that. But you know, the exciting part of what I loved about today's class, we didn't take any breaks. We worked, we were on the edge and fringe. We were working muscular endurance, which is higher repetition, lower weight. But then we were also getting into the hypertrophy muscle strength training part where we were doing at the end with the heaviest weights. We were doing, um, we were doing less repetitions, heavy weight. So today's workout, really, we hit different muscle fibers of our upper body as well. It was a fantastic pyramid hit style training. 
I may do a class like this for our lower body on Wednesday. I won't do the same cardio, none of that. Um, but I will definitely, I think I'm going to hit, I think I'm going to just call it lower body hit pyramid. So we're going to do the same thing, We're going, but we're going to do it for our lower body on Wednesday. And I will do some sort of different style of cardio and hit as well. So yeah, excited about that. Okay, you guys, Anne, so glad that you were here too. Uh, JD of Love was here too. So you guys, Roland, you guys all know my schedule. I'm here this week. Next week, I'll be in Wisconsin. The next week, I'll be back here doing lives. And then hopefully, I'm in Wisconsin doing my lives every single week for you. And I'm just going back and forth between the two studios. So you've got to wish me luck on all of this. You guys all know I'm in a little bit of a life transition with my family as well. So I do have a lot going on personally. I mean, I'm blessed, so it's all good. But, you know, I have a lot going on in my life too. Yeah, and that's what I'm going to do, the lower body hit pyramid style. Uh, I'll do definitely a different type of cardio. I might do power walk. Um, I might. I haven't done a power walk in a while. I might do a power walk uh, and then a power, wa uh, power walk slash jog hit style workout for the first part. Um, all right, Karen, loved it. I finally managed to get some weights, and I like using them, and we'll do this once a week. Thank you. Lots of, oh, Karen. Absolutely. As we get older, I'll be 50 in uh, September. It, you know, and you saw me, I had the 20 pound weights and 15s, 12s. Uh, you know, we can lift those really heavy weights and we truly don't book up, bulk up. Look at me. I am the leanest thing ever. So, um, yeah. So, you guys, what pull ups on the dip bars? Oh my gosh, what a fantastic training! Absolutely, those dip bars are amazing. Okay, you guys, so I hope each and every one of you has a beautiful day. I just want to thank you all for coming. It's such a blessing that I can teach body movement, and it's such a blessing that we get to work out together. We get to just leave everything at the door, and we get to either take this hour or these two 35 minute workouts, and we just say, <laughs> and we get to say to each other, you know what? This is my time for self love. This is my time for self nurturing. This is my time to just move my body and sweat and get strong and feel good. This is my time. You are fearless. You are fearless. And that's what I love about this group. All right, you guys. Thank you, everyone. Have a beautiful day, everyone. And um, I'll get the thumbnail out for Wednesday. Okay, guys. Bye.